what is up guys mobbin here back at you with a brand new youtube video and i'm here with my good friend the duke minecraft hello hello <laughs> and we recently did a collaboration on a redstone project so let's uh show you that now so okay so here it is it is a house yes it mm -hmm. is a nine by nine piston house and we got the idea from mumbo jumbo because we both follow him on youtube and he's a great youtuber and yeah you want to add to that duke yeah recently we saw his nine by nine video we thought it was really cool so basically we tried to make our own and yeah this is what we came up with right here <laughs> yep i mean so it's supposed to be have a bunch of redstone things in it and it's you know i think we took our own twist at it and i think we like it a lot so should we go in yeah let's go in Thank you. Okay, don't forget to shut the door behind yep. you. Yep, gotta shut the door behind me always. Okay, there we go. But, okay, so here's just, you know, like a basic room set up. We have our kitchen with our table, and we actually have a really well-designed closet. It was handcrafted from the finest of woods. Oh, yeah, and we got our nice armor in here. We can yep. gear up. So gear up, why not? <laughs> there we okay. go. You're looking good. Ooh. Nice. You're looking fancy, too. Okay. Yep. So, um, I'm actually... I don't know about you, Duke, but I'm a little hungry. My hunger bar's a little low, so I say we snag some cake. Oh, yeah. Good idea. Ooh, yay. Thank you. Oh, no. Oh, what? What's happening? What the... Oh, that's right. You remember? Remember what we did? We built a base... Or an attic? Oh, yeah. We have enchanting up there, right? Yep. We have an enchanting uh, level 30 system, and then we have lower level enchantments. We have a nice ender chest. We have uh, some regular chests for storage for books. And yeah, I totally forgot about this, but now how do I... Oh, that's right. The button. Sweet. That's right. Okay. That was cool. I totally forgot about that. <laughs> it's like a sandworm just came up from the floor. <laughs> it goes back down. But okay, so I say let's go to the table and eat some cake really quick because I'm really actually hungry. Yeah, okay. Let's just throw it down on the table. Yep. Ready? Oops, here. I'll do mine. Okay. There we go. That did it. <laughs> and the well, basement opens. Yep. Wow. Surprise. <laughs> surprise, surprise. So now we can go down to the basement. I did not expect that at all. <laughs> <laughs> I just want to eat my god dang cake. Can we eat it now? Yeah, there's a th yeah there we go. Yeah, I was really hungry. <laughs> okay, I have some more for you. Okay. Whew. Okay. That's so, yeah. <laughs> so, before you guys say this isn't part of our 9x9 house, it actually is just, it looks big, but it's actually really small, and it's actually right under the house. We just have this really cool mm -hmm. optical illusion staircase. Yes, this actually warps back underneath the house and keeps it in the constraints of a 9x9. So, so yeah, we're pretty proud of that. Yeah, we basically bended the fabric of, like, space and time. Yeah, the Maybe. space continuum <laughs> stuff words yes yeah um. <laughs> so we have a handy cow farm to get all our beef so you know it's a simple cow farm if we hit this bottom button they burn and i'm glad they're dying because now we get steak mm -hmm. and yep and then it just funnels down into this chest so that's really cool um and, and then we, got... we oh yeah some potions over here yeah you just hit the potion button and more potion Yep, and potion, potion for days. And automatically brew some more potions. Thank you. You can splash some potion all around. Yep. So, celebration times. And then, you know, it's just some basic farms in here. Some yep. wheat, some carrot. Yep, it's just a basic button to hit and turn it on. Oh, cool. I like that. Yeah, and then you collect it, and then you can easily replant it. But nah. Yeah, we're, we're, yeah we can do that later. Yeah. <laughs> then we have a nice pumpkin farm where... If you place a punk or a pumpkin grows, it just automatically gets pushed into the hopper, into the chest. So it's nice. You always got to have your pumpkins. As you see, we use pumpkins a lot in this build. So it's yeah. nice to have a farm. <laughs> and then over here, we just got another work farm. You just you know, Pretty simple for all our yeah. potion brewing. We need this. We need to keep stocked and supplied. All natural homegrown warts. Yep. Um, <laughs> and then... <laughs> Uh, yeah, just some storage over here. Because, you know, all the these farms produce a ton of items, and we need mm -hmm. a lot of storage for yeah. all these our are, great resources. 
very intensive farms that have very yeah. big output. Yeah, so. giant output. So it's re these farms are really great. I mean, this pumpkin farm just produces so much. But yeah, I think we should go back up top. Yeah, let's take so a look. So this is everything that's down outside there. Outside again. Yep. But I do want to say that we do have uh, probably one of the best views you one could get in Minecraft. I mean, we just oh, have yeah. an infinity lawn. It just goes on forever, and it's nice and great, you know? We have no neighbors. I mean, isn't that a plus? To me, this is the best feature of the house. You just have wide open windows to the best view out there. But yeah, uh, we should go back outside the house. Okay, yeah. Let's go through our handy-dandy wood door. And it, yeah, there we go. <laughs> and okay, guys. So I I hope you guys enjoyed that little nine by nine piston house. Me and Duke really put a lot of time and effort into designing this. And uh, good thing I want to let you guys know is the redstone's actually very very compact, and it may look like a lot of things and a lot of complicated stuff, but it's actually pretty basic, wouldn't you say, Duke? Yeah, yeah. It's not much at all, actually. Yeah, so we're going to actually do a separate video, so this video doesn't run too long, on all the redstone explanations. So make sure you guys check that out because there's some cool, nifty features we had to come up with and make on our, our own to make this uh, whole project work. But one last thing we want to say is if you guys did enjoy this, you guys should try to make your own 9x9 piston house. And if you guys do, please uh, tweet it, the video at me and Duke on Twitter. And our Twitter links will be down below, so make sure you guys follow us. And if we enjoy it, we'll retweet it and share it to our fans so they can check out your awesome 9x9 house. So it's like a mini challenge almost. If you're up for it, that'd be great. And we want to see your guys' creativity and what you can come up with. Any, yeah, for any, sure. Anything else you want to add? I don't, I don't think so. But I yeah, think other than thank you, everybody, so much for watching. Oh, you're throwing the <laughs> Thank you, everybody, so much for watching. Oh, man. Okay. <laughs> yep. So, yeah, time. thank you so much for watching. We will see you next time, and hopefully there's going to be some more collabs in the future. And I'm on Minecraft. And I'm the Duke Minecraft. All right, guys, we're out. Adios. Bye.